Yo, yo, what's good, what's good? Welcome back to the channel, welcome back to the channel. Solid Co Fitness, it's your boy Ryan, back at it with another video. Hey, look, man, remember, remember, and still remember, we keeping the mind solid and getting the body cut up. Listen, I hope y'all doing well, man. Today is another great day, you know what I'm saying? It's beautiful outside, bro. It's too nice outside not to be outside, but if you're at work, then my bad. But listen up, we're gonna get this work going though, you feel me? Today is what? Today is Thursday, dog. Thursday morning. Thursday morning. I got work later and shit. Alright? So listen, make sure you're at the bar. Make sure you find yourself some bars. You feel me? Make sure you find yourself some bars. You're gonna get it right. Hold on. So let's get it right one time. Back though, I ain't gonna lie, we're gonna do, I want this to make sure, I wanna do this for the beginners too. So we're gonna do five, five reps and five sets, all right? So five, five, five. Five reps, five pull-ups, five shorties in between, but we're doing five sets, okay? So I just did three so far. right there but now our second set so y'all can start off you know you can always start off with less reps if y'all need to and if you got to go down to three three pull-ups but we're gonna but we're gonna just do five for right now and we locking out all the way you know what i'm saying we locking out with these pull-ups right here but we're gonna get a lot of contraction and now we're you know upper back and all that while we do the shorties and shit. So I wanna make sure y'all squeezing, contracting, you know what I'm saying? Focusing on your back, your back muscles right now. All right, we're on our second set. That's our second set. I ain't gonna lie, when we add the little shorties in there, it's gonna be a little more difficult. So, you gonna feel that sucker. You gonna feel it. If you're doing it right, you gonna feel it. All right? So, hold on. Get some water. Make sure you put that, make sure you put that water in your body. Make sure you put that love in your body as always. All right. I'm gonna take the shirt off. It's getting hot already. Right, we're on our third set, all right? We focusing on our back this morning.
got two more. I got two more. Two more, yeah. All right. We're not done yet. We're not done yet. Okay. Right, we only have a fourth set. We're in our fourth set, man. Hope y'all getting right. Like I said, every day, man, you wanna be, you wanna be grateful, bro. When you grateful, dog. I said right now, right now, I'm so thankful that I could drink some water. You know that I have water, that I can drink, you know, all that stuff you gotta be grateful for. Because sometimes you get, so listen bro, it's certain people that can't eat how, eat food regular, how you eat food. They gotta eat it through a tube, they gotta do this, they gotta do that. So all this shit you wanna really be grateful for, bro. And when you think about life like that, you can't really be mad at shit too much. You know what I'm saying? You can't really be mad because you're like, damn. Even though I ain't got all them other things over there, or I ain't living like this, I'm living like this though. I still got stuff. You know what I'm saying? I can still afford to buy some food. You know, I can still afford to hop in a whip, go to my destination, come back to my place. I got shelter over my head, you know? I don't gotta be no luxury apartment I'm living in. I ain't gotta be no high rise and no penthouse that I'm living in. But I'm grateful that I got shelter though. And that's how you gotta really be thinking about your life. Every day bro, not just one time here, then you say F all of that, then you go back to your complaining and all of that. Uh, we're on our fourth set though, we're gonna get right. Stop and drop off the bar. It's all good. Just get your little rest and go back. You know what I'm saying? As long as you get your little rest and go back, you're good. Alright? Got two more. That's it. We just don't do focus on our back. Let me tell y'all something, bro. When y'all be out here complaining too much, bro. Complaining don't do shit for you, dog. Like I'm really trying to tell you, like. Complaining as a man, bro, don't do nothing for you. You must be the one to find solutions. You must be the one to look within and know how you want things to be. You know what I'm saying? You gotta know how you want things to be, bro. I know you're not gonna have life figured out and shit. I don't have life figured out, you know what I'm saying? My life ain't perfect. 
but I'm always working on finding the solutions within me. Cause sometimes you try to find the solutions outside of you. You know, you try to find the solutions through money. You try to find the solutions through your clothes. You try to find solutions through women. You try to find solutions through your family. You know what I'm saying? And then you don't never really find the solutions that you really want or that really that you desire because you're looking outside of you. So you gotta remember like everything that you need, bro, is in you already, dog. You already know what you like, what you don't like. You already know certain stuff. But you letting everybody else on the outside tell you what not to like and what to like. You know what I'm saying? You can't, you can't, you can't live like that because that means you pleasing the outside world and not pleasing yourself. You putting everything outside of you first and not you first. And I know sometimes it sounds selfish as hell. It sounds selfish, like why you always talk about yourself and why you always trying to let the plane go by. You oh, you must put yourself first, bro, because you can't pour water into other people's cups if your cup is not full, if, it, if your cup is not filled, right? So if you out here always trying to do everything for everybody all the time and you, you know, you ain't gonna have no water for yourself, bro. You're gonna be giving it to everybody else and by the time you look at your cup, it's like two little, two little drops in that sucker. And you can't do nothing else. We on our last set though. that right there that's that right there no matter of fact I feel like we can knock some more stuff out real quick. Alright. We can still knock a little something out. Hold on. Process real quick, and then that's gonna be it for right now. For real, for real. ten reps, five sets. All right, you're gonna be hitting wide, you're gonna be hitting narrow. Switch it up a little bit. You feel me? That's our second set. That's our second set. You gotta put the reps in, man. You gotta put the reps in. 
Ain't no shortcut to the game. You gotta put the reps in, bro. Anything you doing, you gotta put the reps in. Whatever you're trying to get better at, you have to put the reps in. You know, you can't do this shit for like three days and stop for like five days and then think you're about to get that that V shape back or that turtle shell back. It ain't gonna work like that. It ain't gonna work like that. You gotta put the reps in, man. Repetition, repetition, repetition. It's like this, it's like the same thing when it comes to women, bro. A lot of people, a lot of dudes be scared to talk to women or don't know how to talk to girls because they don't put the reps in. You don't be outside saying hello and saying how you doing and having, you don't, you're not doing that. That's why you're so dang on nervous and have all that so-called, what, what you call it, approach anxiety and all that bullshit. We don't roll like that, dog. <laughs> you feel me? We're not living like that. I'm trying to get y'all to get y'all to that point where y'all comfortable with yourself, man. We are comfortable in your skin. That's the main thing, bro, is to be comfortable in your skin. You feel me? We're on our third set. Set, all right, we're doing five sets, like I said, and that's it for right now. Well, so I should do some bicep curls. Some bicep curls. It's our fourth set, we got one more set. Ah. One last set. One last set. I said every day, bro, at least you wanna hit that 20 minute workout. That's all you really need, bro. A good 20 minutes of free time and you get to work, bro. That's it, y'all gotta stop, stop playing around with it, man. Find yourself a little 20, 22 minutes, 25 minutes, 30 minutes and put the work in, bro. That's it. I don't care if you're doing just 50 push-ups. I don't care if you're just doing 10 push-ups. I don't care how long it take you to do those 10 push-ups. But you hit those 10 push-ups or you get that work for that 20 minutes. But remember, something is better than nothing, all right? So we got one last set, man, one last set. That's it, man. That is it. That is it. That is it. Listen, man, we out of here. Hope y'all got money with your boy. Hope you thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for supporting the channel. You know what I'm saying? Still rocking. Listen, man, don't give up, bro. Don't give up, dog. Do not give up on yourself. Don't give up on yourself. And don't give up on yourself, all right? So, listen, I want y'all to have a great day today. Y'all have positive energy you know what i'm saying don't let nobody ruin your day don't let nobody come with their bs none of that you're gonna block out all that noise and you're gonna stay focused on the mission all right 
Keep on doing what you're doing. Be proud of yourself. Pat yourself on the back. And listen, man, be grateful, all right? So remember, we're keeping the mind solid and getting the body cut up. We out here. Yeah, dig.